Okay, so here we are with the engine control module that we're going to be installing. As you can see, there's all the numbers on it. We got this one used off the old internet. Kind of opened it up a little bit there. So that's the one we're going to be installing. Um, hopefully it's going to solve our problem on our 2000 Toyota Echo. This unit only cost me $91 as opposed to the $400 for a brand new uh, engine control module. So, let's see if it works. Let's get this thing installed. The first thing you want to do is disconnect your battery. There we go. Much better. The ECM module on a 2000 Toyota Echo is located on the passenger side of the vehicle underneath the glove compartment. This is exactly what it looks like and this is how it's mounted in the vehicle. Upon removing the glove compartment you'll notice that the ECM is held in by these two screws. That's all you need to remove. With those two screws removed, I suggest going forward and unplugging all the cords and cables from the old ECM module. You may want to take a photograph of these cables first to make sure you get them all back in the proper location. But they should be pre-bent to fit back where they came from. After the cables are removed, a slight tug will pull the ECM module free. What you'll notice is that you're going to need to remove these brackets also because you're going to need these old brackets for your new ECM module. Pretty simple. You got a bracket on the back, this one here that goes in with a, a pressure fitting, and you've got the two brackets on the side. The one in the back slips into a mount underneath the glove compartment. I'll see if I can show it to you in this video. It's right there in the back. And here we have the old ECM module completely removed. As you can see, I still need to remove the brackets and mount those on the new ECM module. That's what it looks like when you take it out. Very simple project. This entire project should take you about 15 minutes start to finish. Here we have put the old brackets back onto the new ECM module. See how all those hook right up. A very simple process. Reinstallation is pretty self-explanatory. That clip on the back slides in. Those two bolts in the top or screws in the top screw right back in to the brackets and you will find that your new ECM module has been installed. Go ahead and plug all your cables back in and hook up your battery. You're done.